Well, good morning, Fishaholics. All right, Get inside my car here real quick. We are actually targeting something different for a change today. We are going after Splake. Now, I'm gonna become totally honest with you right out the get-go, everyone. I have never caught Splake before, and oh shoot, I forgot my phone. Nice, forgot my phone. Be right back, everybody. I'm gonna go ahead and get my phone real quick. All right, so like I was saying was, everyone, is that I have never caught Splake before, but, I mean, some people around here where I live have before over the years, and so, with that said, let's go ahead and head down towards the water, and let's see if we can catch ourselves our very first splake of our lifetime, everybody. So, feel free to smash that like button. So, let's go ahead and hit the road. DNR literally just showed up everyone and uh, they're asking these four guys for their fishing licenses. I got a feeling I'm going to be next. Hmm. Well, I've seen several splake coming through, but so far I'm not getting any bites everybody. I think it's almost, I think 11 o'clock now, so I'm going to go ahead and just wrap it up for the day. Kind of bummed out. Not going to lie to you, I'm pretty bummed out. Oh man, I'm kind of disappointed, you guys. There's there's splake here, but they're just for some reason they're not biting. They're not. I've seen several go swimming by and they just have no interest. I tried uh night crawlers, I tried fish eggs, I tried little spoons as well, and nothing was working. Nothing. That was just so weird. I don't know what the deal is. But I guess uh yeah, you guys probably saw that moment there. Uh, the DNR actually uh, pulled up and uh, asked a couple of guys right by me for uh, their fishing licenses. And I had a feeling I was going to be the next one because I was fishing. And surprisingly, though, that officer never bothered to ask me for my license. I'm going to probably try out a couple other areas, see if there's actually salmon. So with that said, uh, we're going to head back to the house just for a little bit. And then uh, we're going to take another little trip and see if we can actually find any salmon this time. So... I'm not done yet, everybody. This video has only just begun. Mm, so we got some eggs here that salmon just laid. Uh, I think I got snagged. Maybe I didn't. I think I did briefly there. Yeah, I did.
Ooh. Looks like one just came up to the surface there. Here, I'm gonna get the rest of my equipment. There, I got on camera. I think I got that on camera too. I think I got that on camera, everybody. I mean, there's salmon here in this river, but they're just not biting for some reason. I don't know why. I mean, literally, I haven't seen them, some explosions on the surface, but I'm not getting any bites. I mean, first we tried splake earlier today, didn't catch any. Now we're going after salmon, still haven't caught a thing. Like, what the heck is going on? All right, folks, so I'm sorry that I'm gonna have to end this video a little bit early here because I was not getting any bites out there. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and actually do a part two to this, everybody, for salmon and trout. And I think I got another location we're gonna try out next time, everybody. That's a little bit closer to the house than where I went to earlier today. So, and I know that a lot of people have caught rainbow trout in this particular spot. And I have caught a few fish in the past there. I actually just recently caught a pike there, I think a couple weeks ago. So with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up, everybody. Um, don't be afraid to feel, um, <laughs> don't be afraid to actually leave a comment down below and tell me um, if you guys can give me a little few tips actually on salmon fishing too, I would really appreciate that. Cause like I said, I haven't done a whole lot of salmon fishing in my lifetime. So I'm still kind of new to it but I'm slowly starting to figure out a few things with the salmon idea, but at the same time, uh, I'm still a rookie at it. So feel free to feel, share a few pro tips with me if you guys can do that. But with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and just wrap this video up, everybody. So I'll see you guys in the next adventure.